Hello, I'm Tim Pennington, editor of Product Finishing Magazine, and here's your top news from the finishing world for the week of August 28th. A new webinar looks at trivalent chromium process capability studies for OEMs. Mark Shario, Executive Vice President for Columbia Chemical, will present information on evaluating test matrix variables and performance results of exterior corrosion testing between trivalent and hexavalent. The free webinar is October 2nd. Visit pfonline.com to register. AGM acquires advanced hard coatings company Duralar. AGM Container Controls has acquired Duralar Technologies, maker of advanced ultra-hard metal coatings and coating systems. Duralar will become a wholly owned subsidiary of AGM. A beer barrel maker improves its product quality with nitric acid-free pickling process. Hinkle has helped a Spanish manufacturer of stainless steel barrels set up a pickling and passivating line using a nitric acid-free process. The challenge in pickling solutions for stainless steel lies in removing all the scale, iron contamination, and welding oxides for achieving a fully passivated surface with an even, clean, and aesthetic finish. CCAI plans a 2020 Women in Finishing Forum. The Chemical Coders Association International will host the second annual Women in Finishing Forum May 6th through 8th, 2020 at the Embassy Suites South Bend in Notre Dame. In our On the Move segment, Joss Wyomi joins Colmet as Eastern Regional Sales Manager. Wyomi has 20 years of experience in coding applications and processes acquired throughout his career at Carlisle Fluid Technologies with Binks, DeVilbus, Brandsburg, and BGK. Our tech tip of the week is choosing between a conveyor versus a batch processing system. Although many companies are converting to conveyor or continuous processes, Bob Hawk from Spray Systems says there are advantages and disadvantages to each type of processing. The innovation of the week is Samez Kremlin's Magma 500 heater. The heater range works up to 500 bar or 7,250 PSI and will heat paint evenly without any burning effect, according to the company. It is said that the fully stainless steel construction makes it compatible with most materials. Remember, you can read all these stories at pfonline.com. You can also sign up for our weekly newsletter that will bring you all the latest finishing news and information directly to your inbox each week. I'm Tim Pennington with Products Finishing Magazine, and thanks for watching.